Okay, let's go ahead and take a look at our quiz question here. So what we want to do is perform this function operation. So we're given two functions and we want to find the function f of g of x. So if you haven't tried this problem, maybe you want to pause the video and see if you can do it now. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at our solution. So you definitely have to know how to kind of some of the basics of functions. So let's take a look at this function f of x equals 2x plus 1. This function here. If I told you to find f of, let's write it over here, f of x equals 2x plus 1. If I said to find f of 2, okay, what would that mean? Okay, of course, most of you should hopefully know that that means to plug in 2 where the x is at. So this is going to be 2 times 2 plus 1, and then we can go ahead and simplify that. 2 times 2 is 4 plus 1. That would be 5. So f of 2 would be equal to 5. All right, so what we did, where the x is at, we plugged in 2, and we simplified the function. Well, what we're going to be doing here is called a composite function, and instead of plugging in a number into this function f of x, okay, where this x is at, okay, what we're going to be doing is plugging in another function, and specifically we're going to be plugging in the function g of x, and it's this part of this function that we're going to be plugging in. All right, so if you're if you're kind of lost on this, you definitely want to go back and review composite functions, extremely important in mathematics. So let's take a look at the rest of this problem. So f of g of x, we're going to plug in the g of x function to where the 2 was at. Remember, this is our function, 2x plus 1. So the 2 is next to the x, so we're plugging in that g of x function. So we have 2 times negative 3x minus 6 plus 1. And then you could just see the algebra here of me uh, simplifying it. Okay, I'm doing uh, the distributive property. I have negative 6x minus 12 plus 1, and then we just kind of walk it all the way down to its uh, simplest form. So we have f of x equals negative 6x minus 11. Okay, so definitely have to know those functions. And, um, you know, if you're confused about this, uh, and some students find this kind of confusing initially, so go back and do some review on function uh, composites. And if you want to take more uh, pop quizzes with me, and especially if you're a homeschooler, hope to see you over at homeschoolmathquiz.com. Have a great day.